All right, today we're making a batch of colloidal silver. And this here is the inspiration for the work we're doing today. I don't know how well you can see that. But this is a diagram off the internet showing a 1.6 ohm resistor, three 9 volt batteries, a red LED, and two 0.9999 pure silver rods to make your own homemade colloidal silver. I've made a couple of improvements on it. I've already cleaned out this beaker really well and I rinsed it with the distilled water and it's filled with distilled water right now. And on top of it is the package that the silver rods came in. And you can see they were 99.99 pure. I'm going to end up putting this on a stir plate keep everything stirred while it gets made so right there we got the little stir bar and that's been cleaned and rinsed with distilled water and this is the uh, the bottle brush indispensable when you're trying to clean these Erlenmeyer flasks your silver rods if you want to make colloidal silver at home should only be cleaned with pure copper scrubby and I think today we're using a chore boy at the end of it all the reagent here will turn the will turn the uh, ionic silver into true colloidal silver true colloidal silver is yellow not clear and the TDS meter there will be able to measure approximately how strong our solution is once it's all finished. So the upgrades, obviously the stir bar, but also this DC power supply. I wasn't too hot on using the three 9 volt batteries. They probably burn out pretty fast. So for about $70 I got this uh, DC power supply and it's just going to mimic the current and the voltage of those 9 volt batteries. I'm using alligator clips. Right there's my 1.6 ohm resistor. And I think over here we got that red LED. My copper rods have already been scrubbed with the copper. Or my silver rods, I should say, have been scrubbed with the copper. And they've been rinsed with distilled water and uh, I've also added a timer. Um, it's going to take about three hours to get the solution to the concentration we want and uh, you know I don't feel like babysitting. So we're going to get everything set up and we'll be right back. 